Well, hello everybody. I'm using my Dwarf 3 to do some photos of the moon. It's a couple days before it's full. And uh, where I'm at in Washington State, we're getting all the uh, smoke fires from uh, California coming up. So it, it almost makes it look like it's an eclipse moon. It's kind of funny because in, in about another three days, there will be a full lunar eclipse during the full moon. But uh, you'd have to be in Asia or Australia or Europe somewhere to see it. You won't be able to see it in uh, the U.S. But uh, next March 3rd, uh, 2026, we will be able to have another one. We'll see from here. And I'm on the West Coast, so we'll get the entire thing next year. But in the meantime, just looking at uh, uh, these photos of the moon I'm getting here, this is quite unique because it almost looks like it's... Uh, an eclipse moon but of course the moon isn't full so this isn't something you would see during a regular lunar eclipse so it's kind of unique right now i'm taking uh let's see 88 photos so far i've got uh, 56 photos taking and it's stacked 11 of them so it's going to make it a real sharp uh, uh looking like an, an eclipse moon so as soon as it's done i'll you know be processing it more but right now this is what it looks like and I'm going to do some more of these. So, uh, you know, this is so much fun. Uh, and the Dwarf 3 telescope, which is set up, of course, right over here. There we go. And it doesn't weigh very much. And a nice, cheap, uh, a real lightweight tripod. I have it uh, uh, powered up to where I won't worry about, uh, you know, going through the battery. Of course, the moon is right there in my backyard. So uh, I'm having, having a good time. Currently, it's at uh, 78 photos, so I'm getting there. You can kind of see from this photo, if I pull it away far enough, that it looks uh, nice and sharp. So far, it's only stacked 16 of them, but it's getting getting there. So I'm using my iPad. I have one of the 12-inch iPads and, uh, you know, connected it by Wi-Fi, so it uh, everything works just fine. It's uh, pretty easy now. I got it down to a, almost a science fiction. <laughs> So you can see at the bottom there, it's at uh, one, let's see, one twenty-fifth of a second. Of course, target moon uh, gain zero. If you turn the gain even to one or two, it'll make it too bright. And then uh, uh, total eighty-eight. Nope, it just uh, went to eighty-eight. Oops, there we go. So stack twenty so far, twenty-one. So as soon as it's done stacking all of those photos, it already looks really nice. I'll be ready to do some extra processing on it. So far, it looks great. Well, I will be back at it. Take care.